We got that daily uh, mentality of, of waste reduction in all of what we're processing. So every product that we make, we're trying to figure out what can we do with the waste. Thank you, Crawford II, um, Air Force veteran, local Detroiter, and um, Vice President of Footwear Operations here at Pingree Detroit, um, footwear maker and co-owner with Pingree Detroit. The problems we're trying to solve here with Pingree Detroit is um, community well, community well-being, um, uh, waste reduction, um, learning a trade. What's cool about my job is um, every day it's a new challenge. Everything from uh, making wallets to sneakers to drawstring bags, it's a new challenge. And it's beautiful to come in and work with local Detroiters and veterans. It's in my blood. My granddad was a, uh, I think he was born in 1905, but he used to do my dad's shoes when he was little. There's several things that I learned in school that helped me with my um, job today. Um, in college, I, I was at Wayne State for a couple years. I did public speaking, um, social engagements, learned how to speak with customers when I'm out doing sales at Eastern Market. Um, I had public speaking in high school, um, AutoCAD, auto computer aided drafting. I had that as a uh, trade school um, with Golightly, uh, Voltec and that got me, uh, that helped me with a lot of digital patterns and design. What I would like to see in the next five to 10 years to change in my particular industry of footwear making um, would be probably more eco-friendly, uh, market more eco-friendly. I see an uptick in it. My advice for those that are interested in cord waning or footwear making or shoe making, um, my thing would be to immerse yourself in sewing, uh, pattern making or design making, physically and digitally. Um, be patient. Um, there's going to be sacrifices and dedications that's going to be applied to a lot of this.